Uh, but Glenn Kamara is a Rangers player. Now, he has uh, said that he was racially abused by a Slavia Prague, uh, by a Slavia Prague player. Um, we're still waiting to hear um, what is going to happen. Um, I would just like to go out there on record uh, like, I have, uh, like I have done on my Twitter and say <clears throat> that I fully believe uh, Glenn uh, Kamara because in the incidents are, you haven't seen it, um, but you can get a chance to see it maybe when you come off the pod. Uh, but I will tell you the incident and I will tell you how the incident happened so you can right away, you right now, you can make your decision on if this is true or if you believe Glenn Kamara or you believe this piece of shit that plays for Slavia Pro. So, there's a madness going on. Glenn Kamara's got the ball. Slavia Pro players come up to him, done this, whispered something in his ear, walked away. Glenn Kamara, another uh, black player who plays for Rangers, even if you watch the scene, you will clock even two of the Slavia Pro players who are black. Must have heard as well because all flat, but all, all, all four black players turn like that. And the two Rangers man run at him. And when I mean run at him, I mean they run at him, blood. Yeah. And Glenn Kamara has come out and said that he was racially abused. And I fully believe him, blood. Because why in God's name is the Slavia Prague player, the, uh, the Slavia Prague player, going to go up to him, cover oh, his mouth, and then say that? Because he do not want the camera to see what he's saying, blood. Do you understand? So I fully believe that he was racially abused. And if he was, Slavia Prague need to be thrown out of the Europa League. And Rangers need to be put through in the quarterfinal instead of them blood. Because that's the only way that we are going to deal with racism in football blood. Because this cannot go on blood. This cannot continue, bro. This cannot continue. The motherfucker has covered his mouth, bro. Has covered his mouth and gone in Glenn's ear blood. And and and, mm. and he we, we don't know like he like he has said to Gerard what the brother said to him. Yeah. And when Gerard was interviewed, Gerard was like, I can't even say what Glenn told me. He said, He said it was disgusting what Glenn told me. And he's like, I know Glenn. He's not gonna lie. I stand with Glenn. I believe Glenn. And I'm I'm out here saying I believe Glenn as well, Blood. And I stand with Glenn as well, bro. And that's exactly what happened, sir. Glenn's got the ball in his hand, the kids come up to him, whispered something in his ear with his mouth, with, with his hands over his mouth. So the camera cannot see what he's saying. Yeah. It's, he, he, he's fucking abused in blood. And Slavia Prague need to be dashed the fuck out and banned. Banned from Europe, blood. That's the only way we're going to deal with this. Blood. I don't want to see this guy getting a ban. I don't want to see him getting away with it. I want to see this club thrown out of fucking Europe, blood. Yeah, that, that, that that's disgusting. I mean, I'd have to go back and, and see the see the the the, the, the actual incident. That, that's but what's happened based on, off, based on, on what my you're saying on my kids' lives, bro. That is what has happened. Based that, off I, what I, you're I, saying, if two other players reacted, if two other players reacted to him doing that, then I mean, <laughs> I mean, if it if it's if it smells like something, it surely is something, right? Type of deal. So they, they should react. And you, he, uh, Glenn Kamara is an Arsenal academy guy. Okay, he was with us. You see what I'm saying? So, you understand? I stand with Glenn Kamara. You understand? Big up your damn self. Hold your chest and high, blood, and keep your chin up, my brother. Yeah? Just remember that at least you, you, you get me. You won the league title, so you get me. You know, say you're a champion. You get me? And then, man, they're just pussy old. You see me? But, um, 